What I'm going to show you here is how to take a Tropico 3 Xbox 360 save and edit it to have more money than you'll ever need on each island. What you have to do first is create the save. And I started the save with $9,500 for money. Just makes it easier for me to, to find because I know that the hex code for that is 251C. So to start, you'll have to have the save file from the 360 on a flash drive so that you can put it on the computer. The first thing you have to do is open a command prompt in administrator mode. To do that, go to accessories and go to command prompt, right click and click run as administrator. That will open up the command prompt window in admin mode and you'll be using that in a minute. First I'm going to go to the flash drive that has the save on it and copy that over to the computer in a directory that I have to work on it called it Tropico. You'll notice that in this directory I already have two files packzip.exe and offzip.exe so you'll need to go out on the internet search for those two files download them and then put them into this directory because this is what you'll be using to extract and unencrypt the data that's in the save file so you can change it and then inject it back into the save file it's a lot easier than it sounds but you have to have these two files first and put them in their own directory I happen to have a save file here that from before that I'm just going to get rid of And I'm going to copy the save file from the flash drive over to the folder on the computer. Now you can go to the command prompt window, go to that folder, and then use the off zip command, as I did here. Now, what this will do is it will extract into this folder several files, several .dat files. Each one is a part of the save file. It just makes it easier to manage. And so I type the offzip command. Make sure you put a zero at the end there. That will extract everything, and you'll see it populate in that folder. Now go into that folder, right click and open with HXD hex editor. That's the hex editor I'm using for this because it's the easiest. You can easily find that on the internet. Once you go into that, you're going to have to open all those DAT files because potentially you could have to search through all of them. It won't turn out that way in reality, but it just makes it easier if you open all of them at once. Once they're all open, we're going to go back and start at the first one and just search for the string or the text money, M-O-N-E-Y. And a quick way to do this once you've typed in money is, uh, and clicked OK, F3, and then enter if it says can't find money, and Control F4 to close the window. And I just keep doing this. I've skipped over a bunch of them here. But all I'm doing is hitting F3, Enter, Control, F4, Search, OK, and then close the window. It goes by pretty quickly. You could do all of this in, in a couple of minutes. Eventually, you'll find the string, and after that string, you'll see uh, some other bytes in between, but then you should see at the end of this um, hex the amount. 251C is 9500. The amount is actually the 00251C. It's three hex numbers. Or three bytes, rather. And what you're going to do is change that 00251C, which is 9500, 
to FF, FF, FF. And that's going to give you a whole bunch of money. Then just save that file. Leave the hex editor open because you're going to need, need the name of that dat file. Then use the pack zip command. which is packzip dash o, the letter o, the address that the file is, which is the same as the name, and then the name of the file, and then the save that you're injecting it back into. There it is, it's injected it already. Now you can exit out of the command window. You've created the new save file, so just take that save file from that folder on the drive, copy it, and then paste it to the flash drive. Copy and replace if there's one there already. And that's it. Remove the flash drive safely by ejecting it. Then use that save file to resign and rehash like you would normally do with the save file to get it back on the Xbox 360. And when you start up Tropico with that save, you will have virtually an unlimited amount of money, more than you can use anyway. So enjoy, and thanks for watching.